What's up, y'all? I got a banger from Alpha Central. Let's get straight into it. Yo, who the f is Brad? Dang, well, that was probably. <laughs> Finally, I can call Brad. <laughs> that is brutal. Act like that. Oh, all right, what? Where you going? Where are you going? Stop. Where are you going? Stop. Where are you going? Stop. Huh? Just, what? You huh? So no. Just admit it. Mike. Just admit you was going to do something, weren't you? I wasn't going to. That's a lie. I, I was just I there sitting by the pool with him about to take my pants off. I wasn't going to do anything. <laughs> Stop it. Me. You don't want the Vegas. You don't want the Vegas right. Fuck him, right? You don't want the Vegas right. Fuck him, right? Please. Get out of here. She really just ran out like that with. She's a runner. She's a track star. Let the streets have her, my man. She's not yours. It's just your turn. I don't care if my husband looks through my phone. If he wants to ruin his day, that's on him. She just admitted to straight up cheating. She wants to ruin his day. That's on him. Put a finger down. Oh, girl edition. Ooh, Put a finger down edition. if you've ever made out with tongue. <laughs> Put a finger down if you've ever done the walk of shame. <laughs> Put a finger down if you're sleeping with my boyfriend. Dude, why? Get out of the car, bro. Seriously. What are you talking about? I thought we were friends. No, but what are you talking about? Bro. Don't act like I'm stupid. <laughs> Get out. It's not funny. Claire, I didn't do it. <laughs> Stop crying. Stop giving me that. <laughs> As she should. I'm happy she. <laughs> what? <laughs> she went from it's a joke to now she's crying and uh, oh my lord, have mercy, bruv. Cheating on the vacation you took her on? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Wow, oh, the amount bro. of disrespect here. Bro, that's brutal. That's I, that's awful, bruv. Cop pulls over a man and finds his wife cheating on him. Lost in some registrations, please. Wow. Uh, sir, in this car, can you please step out of the vehicle onto the left? Hey, partner, uh, I've got this one. Uh, both of you, please, just on the left side. Ooh. It's not looking good enough. The sad piano. What is she wearing? Oh, I thought she had a robot. Can you please face the vehicle and put your hands where I can see them? You too, ma'am. The good old frisk there. Go ahead. They sound, sounds like they um, are from Australia. Been Can drinking, I please no, get sir? you to come over here? Okay, please stand and go in a straight line and put one foot in front of the other. Ah, oh, yes. Um, how long have you known this woman for, sir? Uh, about two Yeah, okay, okay. That's my wife, sir. That's your wife? That is my wife. Mm. Really? Well, I had no idea. I don't know what to say. I mean, I lost the words. Can you please stand back near your vehicle, sir? Oh. I can't believe this. I can't believe it either. Sir, I'm going to need you to go back in your vehicle and you can leave. You want me to go? Yes, yes, sir. You can leave before I get angry. Grab this stuff. Yeah, that's fine. The Hulk smash, leave before I get angry. <laughs> Brutal, bro. Dude, it's like the Hobby Lobby music playing in the back. Come on, we're both victims of our games. Man, it's not your fault. You're not the married woman who made Cinder. No worries, mate. Yeah, it's Australian. Brutal, bro. Imagine. She ain't, she ain't got nothing to say for herself. She ain't said a peep. How could you do this to me? Wasted seven years on this. 
You know what? Oh, yeah, you can call your mum and she can come pick you up wherever the hell we are. Yeah, I'm dead serious. Chad, I would have done the same thing. I would have left her there, bro. There's no way that I would have been like, yeah, honey, hop in the car. I'll take you home. Baby, it was just a little light cheating. <laughs> it was some diet cheating. It's okay. I know the dating scene sucks, but so does getting hurt in an accident. Have you ever found yourself involved in a personal injury case? As an image consultant, I meet a lot of clients who are actually recovering from all sorts of injuries, from car accidents to workplace injuries. And I was actually surprised to see at how many people lose their personal injury cases, which is why I want to talk about Morgan & Morgan, America's largest injury law firm. They specialize in a wide variety of personal injury cases, and they've won thousands of big cases. And if you do end up working with them, they're going to fight for the money that you deserve. Just recently, Morgan & Morgan solidified verdicts in Florida for $12 million and $26 million in Philly. That's up to 40 times the highest insurance offer. And I'm telling you, your case could be worth millions. And the best part is, it's all free unless you win your case. Now, if you've also been the victim of a personal injury or a serious accident, you can visit www.forthepeople.com slash Levi, found in the description below, where you can start your free claim today. She caught cheating while driving him home. Please. She's caught. Please. You're caught. Hey, oh. <laughs> you're getting posted. <laughs> Ooh, she got the thirst traps in there. Ooh, goodness gracious, Sonny boy. She's a runner. She's a track star. <laughs> she's sick. Hey, I'm stuck in this car though. She got to take me home, but damn, I would never trust my Again. Oh, That's crazy work. Went went straight up through the foam, had thirst traps in there, and then she's still sad about it. Hi. Oh god. Hey, what's the move though? You good? <laughs> you good? Uh she's not good. She's she's not too happy about that. <laughs> A quick tip for all the wives out there. If your husband says he's gonna fix something, he will. You don't need to keep reminding him every six months. <laughs> Dang, bro just shut his wife down on the... How many how many drinks does she Move have, though? in together. It speeds up the breakup process. <laughs> Follow me for more relationship advice. I haven't cackled... <laughs> Move in together, it speeds up the... <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. Hey, I'm Sarah. What's your name? Deidre. I'm Dylan Stark's girlfriend. Me too. <laughs> she really said me too. Not gonna lie. That <laughs> Giving a new meaning to the me too movement. <laughs> so I was supposed to go on a date with this girl tomorrow and she cancels kind of last minute, but with an all time bad excuse, something about having to go to celebratory drinks for a coworkers promotion, you know, something you look for an excuse to get out of. Yeah. So what do I do? My petty ass remembers Taylor Swift's in town. So I say, damn, that sucks. I was gonna surprise you with Taylor Swift tickets. Guess you can't go now. She comes back with the, oh, I'd hate for those to go to waste. Let me see if I can get out of it. I said, no, no, all good, sweetie, sorry. I just already invited my mom. She can go, she's a huge Swifty. <laughs> Do I have Taylor Swift tickets? God, no. But now this girl's gonna go her entire life thinking, damn, if only I didn't cancel on that guy, I could have went to Errors Tour for free. And me, I'm probably gonna be alone, and that's just how life goes. Damn, hey, that's brutal. That's a, that's a good move though. That's actually really. I, my man's playing chess here, and this woman's playing checkers. Out of the car. What the? What the are you doing? Jeez, dude, this girl is a str I, I didn't even see another guy in there. This looks staged. What, what's the whole... Where's your daughter? She's nine months. So where's her father? What's going on with you guys? Um, he's in the hospital, so he's very you? ill, so I'm looking for, like, a stepfather. Wait. Oh, no. <laughs> looking for a... St he's ill. I'm not gonna stand by his side. Wow, dude. So... You broke up with him while he's in the hospital? No, I, no, I didn't break up with him. Were y'all not together when he went to the hospital? Yeah, we, we're we still together. Wait, okay. I'm looking for like, uh, you know, just in case. Just in case if he passes away? 
Right. Get the French toast out of here. Are you serious? Yes, Kendra. You have to have one in the chamber, Kendra. Come on now. Yep, you need one in the chamber, right? How sick and demented. Now, for folks that do not know, this clip actually happened a little over a year ago. So I don't know if any of you guys know, but, but I really found out if she found a step dummy to step up. There is no... Wow, that is... Bro, that's crazy work. You gotta keep one in the chamber. Like she's sharpshooting. Like she's at the range. <laughs> Loading up a gun. You gotta keep one in the chamber. <laughs> Brutal. Yeah. yeah. So you guys trust each other? You guys keep it 100? Yeah. Yeah, yeah alright, so what if I set switch phones right now for 30 seconds? Uh-oh. Yeah. What's your name? Lies. So who's Jacob? Who? Who the is Jacob? Alright, give me my phone. No. Uh -oh. Oh, hold on. <laughs> she cooked. <laughs> you doing too much. No, you got caught. Oh. You asked John for some money. Give me my phone. Wow. You asked John for some money for it. You wasn't gonna give it to me. No. Whoa! Uh, Imagine if they never came across this conversation. The gallivanting wouldn't have been exposed. Oh, so crazy too is I asked him for money because you was <laughs> you wasn't gonna give me any. Holy shit! Oh, the dreaded. That that's crazy work. These females out here be wildin'. Don't let a woman trick you like that, bro. Today is not Halloween. Tomorrow's not Halloween. No more tricks. Each where if he's not my husband, he's not my boyfriend. Let's talk about it. What I mean by that is if I am going on dates with someone and I realize that they are not the love of my life, they're not my husband, then I will not put a title on that relationship because how is my husband going to find me when I'm cuffed in a relationship? Bro, she look like Sid from Ice Age. Fired. What are you doing making all these demands? Shit. This woman is so delusional, it's not- I was about to say, honey, your eyes look like they're running away from each other. What are you talking about? Bro, well, people cheating in the car in the parking Let lot. Let me guess, you didn't know she was married, did you? Ooh. Who are you, big guy? She's a runner, she's a track star. Hey, look, I'm the guy that was just popping your wife, man. Walked out of that motel. Everybody's a married woman. Who are you, big guy? Who are you? I'm, I'm not. I'm married. her husband, by the way. Your husband that's not yep. married. Can't go away. Oh, we've been arguing for two weeks, but she's officially split up. I'm glad I just got my kids. Thank you very much. You need your kids. I've lived in my own house for over a year. Get in your old drive. Thank you. Hey, everybody, I'm fixing to make you famous, Bambi. <laughs> you too, whoever you are. No way. This is going to be one. <laughs> she brought that whole thing of water. They must have been going to work in there. <laughs> You, you need the 96 ounce Ozarka? You must be putting in some work. Careful. Next time turn 360 off on your son's phone that tried to get a hold of you all night long. Both of them crying. I want to go to mom's. You're Dang. a real piece of Well. Enjoy that. That's how you get custody of your kids right there. Lay hands on me. There won't be nothing to no, you, no, boy. Lay hands on you, please. Just go away. Where's my children? Your kids are with my mom. Everybody never get a wife like this because they wake up with a stranger. Look on YouTube, you'll find it. Yes, you will. Goodbye, guys. Not only do I- I'll make you famous. <laughs> he sure enough did. Bro, she was beat. <laughs> she was so beat, she wasn't even- she wasn't even cute. Absolutely amazing to finally spread my legs and be- Huh? Be the person that I know I am musically. You just said Stupid. spread your legs. I just said spread <laughs> spread my wings musically. She really Stupid. paused mid sentence to Bro, she dumb as a box of rocks. Spread your legs musically. Well I guess nowadays in the music industry, them ditty parties, I guess it really do be like that. I don't know. Bro, I knew it, bro. Bro, look, look, you see? Bro, bro. Nah, yo, bro, this is the car right there. What is you all talking about? You always do this open the door. That just honestly sucks to see. It must uh, be. Yeah, yeah, it's it sucks, man. It's absolutely brutal. Oh man, apparently Jada quit her job to come to this house. I don't know how true that is or isn't, but she is now threatening to break these things in this house if she doesn't get paid. Somebody in this room is gonna pay me or I'm gonna break the shit. Jada, why would you quit your job? Why would you? Oh my God, Jada. Oh, Jesus. I don't think any of us saw that coming. Like we knew she was mad and threatening it, but like people are mad and threatening stuff all the time. Like they don't actually go through with it, but Jada went through with it. You, Jada, 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 stop, stop. What? 
Drop the shit. Antoine, very poor choice of words. Drop the shit. Oh, but then. Okay, I can't watch it like this. Dana, look, look, look. Okay, stop, 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 stop. That stuff is not ours. This house is rented. This house doesn't belong to him. This is, you're breaking someone else's things. It's not the our next things. Words out of your mouth better be, I will pay you. Ain't nobody paying you. Dana. This girl was out of control. I came to the conclusion that no one, not even Antoine, could stop her at this point. Her power level was way over 9,000. And when I saw her going for the fourth thing to break, I realized that someone had to give in to her demands. Why would, okay, okay, I'll pay you. I'll pay you. Jeez, calm it down. Bro, just tell her that you'll pay her and then don't pay her. Stupid. It's as simple as that. I'll pay you. Like, that's so dumb. Just tell her what she wants to hear so she stops. Many people nowadays waste their time with the talking stage. You want to get to know someone? Cool. Hey, what are you doing this weekend? Let's go out. You know what I mean? Like, why are you going to sit there for months being like, hey, how was your day? <laughs> it's like, do you really give off? about how their day went no you don't so just go right away get the dates going and they never have to deal with the bull dang bro got deep with it and i mean it's facts dude that's why i always say shoot your shot as quick as possible don't go through the little cupcaking phase and the man 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 the back and forth be like i want to see you and if you don't want to see me i'm gonna move on like draw a line in the sand and usually women respect that without communication there is no relationship without respect there is no love and without trust there is no reason to continue Everything about this quote is off. I mean, that's pretty solid. I can't disagree there, bud. One of my girlfriend cheating on me in our apartment, I decided it's time for me to collect my belongings, move on from the situation, and move out of the apartment. So I went to my room, and I found her cheating with the same man once again. She was yelling oh. at me, and he looked like he wanted to hurt me, and she even called me crazy. She really did him dirty. <laughs> bro, he was that, just trying that to... looked completely staged, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like that scene in Old Brother where Arthur, when he's like... <laughs> That looks so staged. That looks so staged. And he did the voiceover of it. Like, bro, come on, bro. <laughs> come on, bro. <laughs> oh god, it's so ridiculous. Um, all right, I want to take I want to take a minute to uh, shout out to all of our members. Shout out to all you guys, man. Let's see if I can't see all the members really quick here. Um, shout out to you guys. Pull these bad boys up real quick. All righty then. Bodega. Appreciate you, man. Tiago, Jacob, Karuma, Turkey, The Dude, Rama. I can't even say that. Gino, Troy, Ryan, Jason, Rallman, T uh, Tennessee Made, Cole, Bogdan, Steve, uh, uh, Lancelot. I can't even say all the names, but I really do appreciate you guys. We have some of you guys that have been here for four months. That's crazy. Ten months. I think this person cares whatever channel. I don't think she watches anymore, but I think she has it on auto renew. <laughs> so it's like... She's just going to keep being here, I guess. Um, but I really do appreciate you guys for all being in the Knicks Nation. I really urge you guys, if you haven't become a member, please become a member. You get access to old videos that are private that you haven't seen. The channel's been growing like absolute crazy. I bet we'll be at 110,000 subscribers before you know it. But I just want to say I really do appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Loki, did you have a good time today? Oh, I mean, he looks like he had a fantastic time. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Go cop the ebook, The Four Pillars of Personality. I think we've sold almost 80 copies now. So shout out to you guys. Uh, but yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, man. And that's the bottom line. Because Levi Nick said so, man. Peace.